As eclipse watchers across North America look to the skies next week, new technology will allow people who are blind or visually impaired to hear the celestial event. Handheld devices created by a team in Harvard can turn the sun's failing light into sound. Graham Stothard explains. It might not sound like much, but for the people testing this out, it could be a window to one of the world's most spectacular celestial events. A solar eclipse, an inherently visual experience up until now. Because a team at Harvard University have been working on a machine that will allow people to hear the moment the sun disappears. We developed a device called the Light Sound that essentially takes light and converts it to sound as a tool for the blind and visually impaired. We're going to have these devices all along the path so people can experience it with sound. It's happening on April the 8th, starting in Mexico, heading northeast through the United States into Canada. The last time it happened there was seven years ago. Some American media dubbed it the Great American Eclipse, but it wasn't great for everyone. Even though we can't see something, it doesn't mean that we can't experience something. You know, we have a lot of different senses and different ways of enjoying different experiences. So what does an eclipse sound like? Well, as the sun shines, it'll start loud and clear. As it dims, it'll get lower before ebbing away into a click. These volunteers have until Monday to make as many devices as they can. We won't see it in the UK, but across the Atlantic, not all eclipse hunters will be looking to the skies. Some will be listening to them. Graham Stothard, ITV News.